In Karic versus Karadzic, we'll see whether a foreign national who was a United Nations invitee could be served with a summons while he was in the United States. The self-proclaimed Bosnian Serb Republic of Srpska controlled a large area of Bosnia-Herzegovina, formerly known as Yugoslavia, during the Bosnian War in the 1990s. Radovan Karadzic, the president of Srpska during the war, directed Bosnian Serb military forces to commit systematic human rights violations, including genocide and rape, against citizens in Bosnia-Herzegovina. S. Karic and other victims sued Karadzic under the Alien Tort Act in the United States District Court for the Southern District of New York. The Alien Tort Act creates federal jurisdiction for torts committed anywhere in the world, even torts committed against foreign citizens, if the torts violated international law. In 1993, Karadzic came to the United States as a United Nations invitee. While Karadzic was physically in the Southern District of New York, but outside of the UN Headquarters District, Karadzic was personally served with the summons and complaint. The UN Headquarters District is a small, designated area around the UN Headquarters in New York City. Karadzic moved to dismiss the lawsuit. Karadzic argued that the court lacked personal jurisdiction and subject matter jurisdiction. Karadzic also claimed that he was immune from service of process because he was a UN invitee. The district court dismissed the case for lack of subject matter jurisdiction. Karadzic appealed. Even though the district court didn't address the service of process issue, Karadzic argued on appeal that he was immune from service of process under a UN agreement known as the Headquarters Agreement as well as federal common law.